Hi all, this is um, a quick video showing you how to get hold of our latest template library from the Sixth Sense support forum. The template library is essential for speedy programming of PS4000 or any DDC controller project. Um, the, the template library is always evolving. You can see the current version of the, pro of the template library uh, on, the, on the website. First of all, you must gain access to the support forum. So you log in to sixcents.com and access the support forum and then log in and you will be presented with the navigation tree on the left hand side suitable for which product you're interested in support on. Uh, we need to navigate to Keyback Peter. If I click on Keyback Peter, there will be the tree called PS4000 and then there will be templates and we are interested in PS4000 software templates. Point data import lists are covered in another video. So PS4000 software templates and they're always contained in this zip folder that you can download. So that's what I'm going to do. So I click on the option and click on, click on download. It will prompt you to save the file. I suggest you save it. And now I can look in my download folder and here we have templates.zip so I open up the containing folder there it is I right click on it and I can now cut that and I can paste that into the folder C PS4000 and project I just right click and paste okay so there it is in order now to um, export the contents I right click on the folder and I go into my 7-zip utility. I use 7-zip, I find this much more reliable than WinZip or other programs that are available and you can download 7-zip in the utilities folder on our website. It's just a simple executable and as I said I fully, fully recommend it. Uh, you open the archive and I can now extract that and it will reside in the C PS4000 project folder and just say OK. That's done. Now if I go back and browse PS4000 project in the template folder I now have I've got two files, files called template one is the zip file which I can now delete And now I've got my folder which contains all of my template library. This allows me now to carry out onward programming using PS4000. And to access the folder, I open up PS4000, I choose my controller, I right click on it. Sorry, I don't choose the controller, I choose group zero, right click on it, I select new. And now I can browse the template folder and all my templates are there. So please always make sure you use the latest template files from Sixth Sense. These do contain additional templates and they also in contain um, tweaks and enhancements onto the templates that have been previously launched with feedback. Okay, so inside the template folder you've also got a documentation folder which contains uh, all the PDF documents uh, covering all of the templates that are numbered inside the folders okay so these numbers are available if you open up a particular group for the template say gas water heater each template's got its own number and you can find a corresponding document discussing that template inside the documentation folder As we add templates into the program, I just choose one at random and I add that into my scheme. I'm waiting for my laptop to uh, catch up with what I'm doing. It's having a bit of a slow day today. There we go, so that's added in my template. And I've got another 
zone one heating there. If I want to add in another template, right click on group zero, really is having a slow day today. And select new. Um, the previous templates are contained in a drop down list. Okay, so the more familiar you get with using templates, you'll find this list grows quite rapidly and then it can become a little bit inconvenient because it stops you progressing and having to keep searching for the same files in this list rather than grabbing them directly from the template library. So in order to reset this list there is a file that we can remove each time we open a new project. This file can be found in the C PS4000 project directory and it is called item type templates and this is just a small file which contains all of, a list of all the templates that we've previously opened. Now you can delete this file at any time before or during a project and it will reset that list ready for when you want to uh, start creating more projects. See now the list is empty again. And don't be frightened about removing that file I just simply create another entry, add in that item of plant, next time I go back the list is already started to be created and that file has been regenerated. Okay, so um, please practice uh, bringing in the latest templates, please observe when notifications are issued to you about new templates being available, so grab that file and use it for your, for your projects. Any feedback about the templates, uh, please go online or drop an email to info at sixcents.com. Okay, thanks for watching.